So hi friends, this is Amit and you are watching my channel information and educational video. So in this video, I will talk about CSAB counseling 2021. As you all know, after JOSA, there will be a CSAB counseling which you can get the college at a very low rank as well. So here I will try to provide you all you need to know about this counseling because many students don't know about this counseling. So I will try to provide you that here that is what is the eligibility criteria of which type of a student can participate in this counseling. What about the fee that you need to pay at the time of registration and what about the refund policy of that fee that you need to pay. And uh, also I will talk about the expected cutoff for NIT, IIIT, GFTI and by watching this video you will be able to know what is the safe rank to get a NIT, IIIT, GFTI through CSAB round category wise for general AWS, OBC, SC, ST all type of a student I will consider here. So if you are first to my channel please try to subscribe this channel so that you will get all type of information regarding the JOSA counseling, CSAB counseling and other counseling other interest exam also in this channel only. So please try to subscribe and one more very important information it is if you need counseling guidance for JOSA counseling or CSAB counseling you can contact me through Instagram or WhatsApp number once you register with me I will guide you for everything from now till your admission is done and if you are planning to do CSAB round because your rank is low try to contact me as soon as possible or any other experienced person so that your, your decision making should be clear at the time of CSAB choice filling because if you will confuse at that time you will lose your seat that you are deserving at your rank so it is advisable to take the help of any experienced person if you don't have I am here to help you because in previous year also I have seen so many students who did mistake and after mistake no one can do any type of thing and now itself in JOSA uh, counseling so many students are coming to me after doing the mistake so once you do any type of mistake you will lose your one academic year that is very important for a student so it is advisable to do all the thing carefully if you don't have the experience or if you are not having the confidence of that you can contact me anytime through Instagram or WhatsApp number so that I can help you in all the thing from now till your admission is done and it will be my responsibility to provide the best out of your rank in each counseling that you will do and especially in CSAB counseling because you are looking for NIT, IIIT and GFTI. So if you want you can contact me anytime through Instagram or WhatsApp number available in the description box. So let's just start this video. So here is the steps and condition of CSAB round. So, so please try to listen my words carefully and watch this video till the end so that you will have the complete information regarding the CSAB round so that you, you will be prepared for that. Uh, so here is the first question that is registration and schedule. So as of now the registration and schedule date is, isn't announced once the voucher will be released for 2021 CSAP counseling. I will try to provide your detailed information regarding that and I will provide you a separate video for that. Once the JOSA counseling will end then after there will be a CSAP counseling and the main purpose of CSAP counseling is to, see or to fill the vacancy that is available after the JOSA counseling in NIT, IIIT and GFTI. Policy. So next if you talk about the fee and refund policy. So there will be a particular fee that you need to pay at the time of registration and uh, and once you get the seat uh, that will be non-refundable if you will not get any type of seat then you will get the refund of that amount 100% in your account. So no need to worry and the fee payment will be around 40 to 60,000 because every year it is changing. So you can expect 50,000 or even 55,000 also you, you may have to pay but, but as soon as the information for 2021 will be released I will try to inform you the exact amount what you need to pay as of now you can expect 40 to 60 thousand will be the fee that you need to pay at the time of registration it is not like JOSA where once you get the seat then you will pay they will take your money first then they will provide you a seat so, so the importance of choice filling is very much in this CSAB round of counseling so try to do that carefully and if you have any type of doubt regarding that you can contact me now itself so that we will discuss everything regularly so that at the time of choice filling you will not have so much confusion in your mind. So next if you talk about can we participate with a seat in JOSA suppose if you are doing JOSA counseling and you got a particular seat up to 6 round you will have a particular seat in your hand so after that whether you will able to do CSAB or not the answer is yes you will able to do it but once you get any type of seat in the CSAB round your, your JOSA counseling seat will be lost so it is very important to do all the thing very correctly because I have seen in previous year many students lose their good seat so it is advisable to take the help of any experienced person before taking any type of decision because it is very important regarding your career you might lose one academic year because of your mistake because in previous here I have seen so many students who lose the deserving setting and they, they were forced to take a drop for next year of J. So it is advisable to do all the thing carefully. That's why I am making this video a little bit early so that you all will know about the CSAB counseling. 
so next if you talk about can i participate without attending josa suppose if you have not registered for josa counseling and you are looking for csab of course you will able to do that firstly you have to do the registration at the csab and then you have to pay the fee and then you will able to do the choice filling and all the things similar to josa counseling so next if you talk about what about the choice filling and expected cutoff so try to listen uh, listen my word carefully because now i will provide you very important information regarding the csab counseling choice filling that is most important thing once you do any type of mistake there you will have to regret later because later nothing can be done as you are facing the problem in josa counseling you might face the same problem in csab because i have seen so many student who have done the wrong choice filling in josa counseling and they are now regretting because you can't change the choice filling so you have to be very clear at decision making whether i should go with this or that whether i should take a good college or good branch so all those thing needs a detailed discussion and it is possible only when you contact a experienced person separately it is that's why it is advisable to take the help of any experienced person if you don't have i am here to help you whenever you want you can contact me through instagram or whatsapp number but if you need counseling guidance then only because for that you have to register with me so i am not telling a detail about the choice filling because there can't be a general choice filling for all the student because different student have different type of rank different type of personal interest and different type of family background so it needs a detailed discussion then only it will be possible so once you contact me i will try to discuss with you if possible with your parents so that i can discuss all the thing and after that i will provide you a separate choice filling list for you so that that will be helpful for you and you will get the best out of your rank that will, that will be my responsibility once you register with me and what about the expected cut off so in csab the cut off is unpredictable no one can predict the cut off because cut, cut off can go up to any rank so if your rank is very low that is uh, 2 lakh 3 lakh or even 4 lakh and you are from general or any other category then you should do the csab round of counseling because uh, you may get the college at very low rank as well and yeah. especially if you are from reserve category then, then you must do it because the, if there is if there will be one seat available it might go up to a lower rank uh, also so there, there can't be a fixed cut off for uh, csab round that's why it is very unpredictable but i will try to make a separate video for csab round expected cut off for all nit all triple it gfti branch wise for top and top 10 average and lower so that yeah, you, you can, can estimate yourself which type of college with which branch you are going to get in the CSAB 2021 counseling so next if you talk about how many rounds will be available so as of now the uh, there will be two round of counseling will be available in CSAB 2021 counseling but if there be, uh, there will be availability of seat after two round then, then they might conduct the third round of the CSAB counseling as well so next if you talk about the should, should i do csab counseling or not this is also very important question because you might lose your money as well or you may lose your seat that you have already got in the josa counseling or you may get the benefit as well so all those thing needs a detailed discussion and you should be very clear at decision making to take this type of decision if you have any type of confusion i am here to help you any time you can contact me so that we will have a separate discussion because you might lose your money as well as one academic year also so it is very advisable to take the help of any experienced person i am repeating this statement again and again because this is very risky csab counseling is not easy so that's why i am providing your video a little bit early so that you all will be prepared for that so if now if you talk about the answer of this question then i will suggest you yes but it depends a student to a student as well and if you are thinking my rank is low i will not do that is not the case if you have any type of rank you know whether it is very low or good you should do with this counseling to maximize your chances of getting the good college so this is all about this video here i provided you all the term and condition regarding the csab counseling 2021 so hope you find this video very useful so please try to subscribe this channel so that you will get this type of video in future also about other counseling and other entrance exam and uh, one more time i would like to inform you if you want counseling guidance for csab josa or jack delhi jack chandigarh comet k kct any type of counseling you can contact me through instagram or whatsapp number once you register with me i will guide you for everything until your final admission is done and is done and i will also help you to take the decision whether i should go with this college or that college because that is also an important process of the counseling so if you want you can contact me through instagram or whatsapp number available in the description box anytime so thanks again for watching this video please try to subscribe